In this video, I'm going to show you how to list a domain for sale in your Cedo account. Go to Cedo.com and log in, and then select Add Domains in the navigation bar. In option one, add the domains that you want to list, separating them with a space or a comma. Before you click to go to step two, be sure to review our user agreement and guidelines. Then when you're happy with these, check the box to agree to them. You can now move on to step two. When proceeding to step two, you're going to be asked if you want to use our wizard. For the sake of this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to add the sales settings without the help of the wizard. Now on this page, this is where you enter your sales settings for your domains. I talked in detail about how to choose the right sales settings for your domains in the last video, giving examples of how they will show to potential buyers. The video is called what sales settings to choose when selling domains, buy now versus make offer. So you may wanna check that out if you're unsure what to put in as the minimum offer, the price, make offer or buy now. We talk about that in a little bit more detail in that video, so check it out. Please only enter amounts using numbers only. Do not enter any decimal points or any commas in there. Start by entering your price option. Choose either buy now or make offer if you're selling the domain or choose not for sale if you're simply just parking the domain with us and not selling it. If you are selling the domain as make offer, then you can select a minimum offer, which is the lowest amount you will consider starting a negotiation from. A minimum offer is not required if you have selected buy now as the price option. In the price column, enter your asking price. If you are listing as buy now, then that will become the fixed price for the sale. Or if you're listing as make offer, then it will be the asking price. Choose a currency from Euro, Great British Pounds and US Dollar. In the final column, select domain if you are selling the domain only, or select project if the domain is being sold with a website attached to it. Also, if you are adding more than one domain, you can edit multiple domains at once if you select the edit pen in the blue tab next to the required column, input the amount, then select the domains that you want to make the changes to, or alternatively, by clicking the checkbox in the blue banner, this will apply the change to all the domains in that column. Select the green tick box to apply any changes. Step three is all about activating CDO MLS Premium. You can skip this for now. You can activate it later on in your account. Just select finish adding domains. For more information on Cedo MLS, check out our video called What is Cedo MLS and how to activate Cedo MLS Premium. You are now seeing the message saying that the domains are currently being reviewed at Cedo, but you will actively have to verify the domains to prove that you have the rights to sell them. Until you do that, the domains will show as not for sale in your Cedo account. In the next video, I will show you how to verify a domain for sale. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss out on the new content that we're releasing and stay tuned to watch the verification video.